Hello hi everybody, it's Anna and this is my latest video from Anna's Latest. And in today's video I decided to do a review on the Primark slash Penny Silly Sponge. Silly Sponge? Well it's a silicone sponge and this is what it looks like. It's just like this and uh, I've seen it in Penny's and I was like oh I wonder if that works because I've seen well, I don't, I've seen like a lot of people use these but like I don't know if they're from Penny's they're probably like a really expensive brand but this was really inexpensive I think it was like two euro for two of them so like literally one euro each like you could not even go wrong just to try it so I picked it up to try it and the results are in the video so before you get into this video please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel to see more and that's it so let's get started okay so this is like what it looks like it generally looks like something that you like put in your boob to make them bigger but we're just gonna roll well, it so i'm also just using this l'oreal true match foundation just to see so like it goes on I feel like I'm gonna make a mess of this but we'll see why did I put it there like it doesn't blend like I think what you do is you put it on with this and then you blend it out because this you could not like only use this on its own It really shows you like your hair as well, like how much actually hair you have on your on your face. But I just got this all over my face and usually I only like cover like a wee bit of my face with it. But I because I literally only squeeze it like four times. And we actually have some left. So At least you know like you're not losing anything because it's not being absorbed into and so if you had like a really expensive foundation then you'd know. So this is what it looks like. I don't know if it's going to be good quality. So I'm just going to blend out with this wet beauty blender. definitely like makes my foundation full coverage like more coverage than it would be but I wouldn't like jump for this product how do I have a scrap on my forehead what the hell but so that is a blended out Like it definitely sits nicer, in my opinion. But like, there's nothing extraordinary. I actually find this really weird. But this is so inexpensive. I think it's like two euro for two. So you're literally paying a euro. Like it's you're not losing it in much. Like I definitely use it just to apply, but it doesn't blend at all. Like I don't even think that's their job to blend. But, like, it doesn't 
but um, it does make your foundation sit nicer like you don't need to use as much foundation because you're just blending it in with your beauty blender rather than putting it on like I put it on the beauty blender which is actually bad now that I think of it because I would never I still have like some left in my hand and I blended on it so Okay, I'm um, just letting everybody know I did use this um, Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser before my foundation just in my T-zone and no, actually just on my nose and my chin and I used the Devon by Demi um, 3-1 Moisturising Primer as well just on my cheeks just if people want to know it, that if I used it. So I'm just going to use this for my concealer as well. Just to see like if it works for concealer. This concealer is um, Bella Pierre Cosmetics. Um, my sister got me this for Christmas. But I did see a shop in Drogheda of like this brand on its own. So I was a bit shocked when I seen it. I usually apply this with a brush, but today we're going to do it with this. Like, it's hard to like blend it out with this. Like, I know I said that a couple of times, but like, I have... Sorry about that. So I'm just gonna put that and I'm just gonna blend it as well with the beauty blender. So like it's good to like apply like your things but it's I I wouldn't like I suppose like you're not out a euro like I would give it about eight out of ten like because it does save your foundation and your like concealer but you still need like your beauty blender like you can't just apply it with that like it's really just an like oh thing so I'm just going to do the rest of my makeup so okay so that was the silly sponge as you just seen and um yeah so I really hope you enjoyed this video and please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to follow my Instagram which is at Anna's Latest and my Twitter which is at Anna's Latest with an extra T because um i took it myself i say that in every video like i think people know now that i took my own username but um yeah so this was a silly sponge and i'd i would definitely invest in it just to have it like it's until like you can afford or to see if you like it before you invest in a really expensive one because i don't think i would in my opinion like this one's fine for me like it's literally one euro so i'll be using this and that is it so and also videos are not going to be on Tuesdays and Friday anymore they're going to be Tuesdays and Saturdays simply because today's Saturday so I've decided oh maybe I should change it to Saturday then it gives me like more time to record videos during the week because I will be studying